Do you know what every homeowner asks when their foundation is showing signs of distress? They ask why? What is causing this? And that's why you're here on Ask an Engineer, because this is where you come to get simple answers to complicated questions about concrete and foundation repair. So, let's go. Here's the facts. In most places, the near surface material surrounding the foundation will be some sort of clay soil. And the layers of beneath your home can really be anything. The most important thing to understand is that most clays have varying degrees of sensitivity to moisture. When they get dry, they can shrink, and when they get wet, they can swell. With some clays, it's a little. With others, it's a lot. When some soils get wet, they can soften and collapse. Changes in soil volume and soil strength are in lockstep with changes in the amount of moisture they hold. So again, foundation problems are caused by changes to the surrounding soil, which are caused by changes in the amount of moisture in the soil. This might remind you of a very popular quote, nothing is constant, but change. So whether your foundation is experiencing problems or you're just interested in preventing them, I always encourage people to focus their energy on researching the things that they can more easily control. Have an effective system of gutters. Have downspouts that discharge far away from the foundation. Check that the ground next to your home is sloping down and away. Also check that the drainage system in your home and the sump pump are working properly. Spend your research energy towards other things like figuring out who coined that phrase I just mentioned. If you know the answer, feel free to drop it in the comments right after you smash that like button. Thanks for joining us here today. I'm Kyle, this is Ask an Engineer, and I'll see you next time.